So today's topic is about future vision quest. This is where you are visiting yourself or you're visiting a situation or a place in the future. Yes, it's possible. It's uh, one of the exercises in my New Beginnings coaching program. Uh, it's the way that you can see evidence of manifesting. So everything that you are doing today, every choice that you make, every decision that you make, everything you agree to do or, or, or disagree, you're not going to do it. Uh, every action that you take, every thought, every thought that you have about yourself, about others, will be manifested in the near future and it can head on into the distant future a year from now, maybe five years from now. In my work, we usually are looking uh, one year from now. Uh, sometimes we're taking a peek into five years, but uh, I'm usually working with people that are interested in going through an arc of transformation in the next year. So we work to see what kind of uh, results you get from what it is that you decide today. Right, So you're engaging, manifesting, and there's a result. Sometimes you see the result of manifesting right away. Sometimes you don't see it for a year. So going on a, uh, on, a, on a future vision quest, and I call it visiting your future self. So going in and visiting your future self allows you to observe what you created. And then you can decide in your present time, in your present life, if what you are creating, right? The trajectory is to future is what you really want. And if it is great, you know, you've got a response, you've got a good answer to that. And you can keep on doing what it is that you're doing and get the result that you want. If, however, you're not seeing it, it means that there's choices that you aren't making currently that are going to manifest what it is that you want in the future. So that's the first reason why you uh, would want to or consider uh, doing uh, visiting your future self in a future vision quest. That's number one. The second is that there's a, it's an opportunity for you to have a conversation with your future self and ask some questions. Just like when you go into the soul record and you're asking your soul record, uh, or maybe you are going into a meditation and calling your spirit guides. It's, it's that same sort of uh, device or technique. So you're going to go in there and you can actually talk to your future self and say, what do you love about what you created? Can you tell me what it is that I need to be concerned about as I'm trying to create uh, a life that I love or create change or, or transform? And your future self will be able to say to you, yes, here's what you need to look out for. Here's a mistake I made. This is something I would not do again. Be careful about. Uh, get rid of this person in your life and you'll be home free. Uh, recreate this situation. Change your job. Relocate. Whatever. Your future self, your future self, having already experienced uh, what it is that you're creating, will be able to share with you a couple of a couple of things as a heads up to watch out for. And that's that would be. Wouldn't you love to have that? <laughs> Great news. So. This is why I, I use this uh, technique in my coaching, because it's effective. It very quickly, you're able to gather information. You're able to gather from a place where all of the manifesting has already materialized. So I call it visiting your future self. Now, um, how to do it, right? That's a different question. How to do it, how to, how to go on a vision quest to visit your future self and uh, observe and gave, gain guidance uh, is a technique that I'm teaching next week. And I'm teaching it to the subscribers of my email list. It's uh, called Visit Your Future Self. It's a free class. If you're on my email list, you will get a notice about it and you'll get a link to be able to join me. And if you're not on my email list, it's very simple. You can just get on my email list if you want by uh, going to my website, trulyliving.net, and just signing up for one of the freebies there, right? The, the newsletter, the, you know, the, the meditation guide, uh, the free intuition course, something like this. Uh, then you'll get that too, and then you'll, you'll be on my e-list. Of course, you can always send me a direct message here on Instagram, or you can send me a direct message on Facebook, and I can uh, give you the link to be able to sign up. But it's easy enough. I think we all know how to sign up for an email list, right? 
So you can just go ahead and find me. So uh, that's what uh, I, 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 I'm leaving you with today is the benefits of visiting your future self. You know, it's called a vision quest. Uh, and it's, again, it's to observe the details of what you have manifested based on what you have decided to do today, tomorrow, next week. And also to have a conversation with your future self about what it is that you did to help you along the way to, to get what it is that you really want and also to, to uh, guide you on what to avoid the mistakes that you, that you might be making, okay? And the free class on how to do that is January 21st. It's a free class exclusive to my email subscribers. If you want to uh, learn how to do it, uh, and I'll be taking you there, we'll be doing it together. Uh, you can get on my list and you'll get the link to do it. All right. Otherwise, have a great day. Love from California. Uh, see you on Thursday. Bye for now.